Hey, what's going on everybody? Alex here with Freedom Mowers. Hope you all are having a great Memorial Day weekend. Um, you know, this is a weekend of remembrance of those that paid the ultimate sacrifice. If you guys have seen my first video, you know that I served six years in the Air Force and uh, every single day I'm appreciative that I am here and that I get to spend time with my family because there's a lot of people that don't have that privilege and uh, this weekend is about remembrance of them. On a lighter note, I just want to say thank you guys all so much. We hit the 500 subscribers and uh, man, I am blown away and appreciative of every single one of you all that has come and joined the channel and uh, you know, just watching me work on small engine equipment. Um, I picked up a bunch of stuff this last week and I was going to share that with you all. Uh, this is pretty much going to be all the up and coming stuff. Got a... Uh, what is this LT 2000 uh, so 2012 and unfortunately I have the deck over there but it is almost totally rotted out so I don't think it's gonna be salvageable hoping that maybe I can come across the deck other than that I don't even know I mean the guy said it ran was parked but you know how that goes this was a freebie uh, that was also a freebie um, I'll tell you guys the backstory on this when we get to the video, but it's, I don't know, they wrote that it had a bunch of different problems, and uh, hopefully we can get all that sorted out. And then I just picked this up last night. Uh, I paid 150 bucks for this, running, driving. Um, I have the deck over there with bad spindles. And then over on the other side of the Suburban and the John Deere, I have another uh, Craftsman deck. So between the two, I'll have a good one for this. And for the 150 bucks, I got that tractor with the deck, some other parts with it. I also got this Aaron's pretty much LT1000 uh, hood. Uh, what else? I've got stuff everywhere, so bear with me till I get things cleaned up. Uh, I got this Craftsman WC2200. It's just a curved shaft string trimmer. It's missing a carburetor, but I have the air box and everything to go along with it. Um, just got my mower back, actually. Um, the seal on the right side hydro uh, decided to walk itself out and lost almost all my hydro fluid in that side. It's still under warranty. So I had the dealership actually work on that. You guys can shame me all you want, but uh, I figured since I paid for the warranty, I was going to have them do the work on it. And got a Honda, what is this one? The HHR216. It's a clean machine. Got the bagger. I've got the mulch plug. It's got the smart drive on it. Also, that did not come in that deal. Sorry, I got sidetracked. Um, I got the LT3000, that hood, that string trimmer. And the guy also threw in a um, Briggs & Stratton opposed twin. I can't even remember the horsepower on this. Uh, what was this one? 18. From, uh, oh lord, this thing is heavy. 97. So, 1997, a post twin. No idea what's wrong with it, if anything. Um, yeah, shop's absolute mess. You guys can see, I got stuff everywhere out here. Um, alright, let me cut this and I'll bring you guys over to the other side of the yard. Alright. Well, I picked this one up this morning. Uh, they said the gas cap was stripped out on it, so they didn't want it anymore. So, uh, it's an MTD freebie. I don't know what else is wrong with it. Henning tried to start it. Picked up this older Craftsman that looks like it's been sitting for probably like five years. There is so much stuff caked up underneath the bottom side. Primer bulbs hard as a rock. Um, so I got those two this last week, freebies. Still trying to finish up the uh, mower that apparently will never leave this house, the DYT4000. I still have to seal up the seat on that 
and a battery, if I remember right. I think that's it. We still got to get to this Scott's John Deere that's in like mint condition besides whatever was going on with the transmission. Hopefully that's not a uh, deal breaker on that. And I've been working on the uh, Toro Pro line. <clears throat> Uh, I've got parts ordered for that, spindle bearings, and a new drive belt. Um, and I did fully go through the carburetor and got that tuned. So, yeah, just a lot going on. Uh, we finished up the walk behind and just been busy, busy, busy. So that's kind of what's going on. You guys can see I've got a ton of different projects. We still got that John Deere over there. We still got the last Sears Suburban hadn't even got to yet. Um, so it's just kind of compiling and there's just so much stuff that I need to get to work and get organized. So hopefully, uh, hopefully you guys are looking forward to that content and I'm sure that I'll drag home more stuff in the meantime. So thank you guys once again so much for the 500 subscribers. You guys are awesome. Um, you guys have given me a lot of confidence in uh, making these videos and uh, just having some fun and uh meeting some new people it's been great and uh, i hope you all are out there enjoying your memorial day weekend and uh i look forward to uh the next video and sharing whatever i got going on so thank you guys as always and let freedom ring let those small engines sing i'll see you all next time